you already graduated. Um, you could have not come back, moved on. Why, why come back for another season? Well, um, I've been here for a while, and I think I'm more excited th about this year than I have been in any other season. Um, just when I come in, when I came in, we were at a really low point in the program, and just to, to be here and watch it build back to what it is, what it's gotten to, has been really special. So I just wanted to see that through, and I feel like we have a really great group. And excited for this year. What excites you most about this year's group? Um, probably the 12 team playoff. Um, that I feel like we have a great potential to get into that and win the SEC, and that's our goal. And if we, if we do that, then we can accomplish anything we want. And I feel like we're really close, and uh, we have a great brotherhood in the team. So I'm just excited for that. Coach Eckler was talking about some of those high pressure situations that he puts the kickers through. Kind of tell us a little bit about what those are, are like and how your guys are doing there. Yeah, uh, most practices we'll do like a pressure kick at the end, so we'll bring up the entire team, and they'll just like get after our kickers, just try to put, just try to simulate what happens in the game as much as possible because we can't go out there and kick in front of 100,000 every time, and just we just get to press pause in that in that time and just really focus on our job and just work on executing. Is there anything you can relate to those those kickers that I don't think any of them have ever had like a pressure kick in a game? You've been, you know, <coughs> pressure snaps for four or five years now. Is there anything you can relate to them that they can? Um, take? I would say the biggest thing to focus on is just doing our, we talk about doing our 33%. So I do 33%, holder does 33%, kicker does that 34%. So it's just, we do the same thing every single day. So it's just, when it comes to those pressure situations, we're just doing that, what we do every day, a snap hold kick, and we just, we're really out there with each other. So just focusing on that. What would you describe Mike Eckler on a, like, what he's like on a day to day basis? Um, I think his Twitter is a pretty good representation of what he's like. Um, he's high energy. He uh, loves uh, his players. He loves his family. He loves everybody. Um, gives his all for everybody every single day. And that's what you want out of a coach. So I'd like to play for him. What, what about, tell, tell us about those three, those three guys in that kicker competition. Like mm -hmm. how close is it? What do you, what do you think about them in that, in that role? Yeah, I mean, they're all extremely talented. They're all, they're all on the younger side a little bit. and. Don't have much uh, game experience, um, but they're all c uh, super capable of doing it, and we'll see who it, who it gets to in the fall. Uh, Coach Eckler was talking about Jackson Ross big time. What, what's your view of him seeing him do his thing every day? I love Jackson Ross, and it's been really fun for me to transition from going from a more of a pro style guy to just being able to do anything and just spraying it left and right, kicking with both feet. It's <laughs> made my job more fun, and I really enjoy working with him. How much pride do you take um, running down the field making a tackle on fun? A lot of pride. Yeah, <laughs> it's it's when I get to have fun. So I really appreciate doing that. Do you ever take part in circuits with the defense, like being in a practice? Or no, anything? they won't let me do it. They don't <laughs> want me to get hurt. But I would if they let me. <laughs> go, go back to Jackson. He seems like he's kind of a character. Like what, what's 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 kind of the how do you describe how what he brings to the battery? You guys, you talked about the, the three different part. What kind of character is he? Um, our job can be pretty intense at times, so it's nice when you have guys with great personality to just really like calm the situation and just being able to go to work and not be super stressed out all the time. Uh, Coach Hype talks about like he just wants us to have smoke break sometimes and just relax and <laughs> and then go out and do our job. So it's great to have his personality, and a bunch of other guys in the in the room have a great personality, so it's fun to be around. On the other end, he was talking about tackling. What do you see from the returners, the, those, those guys that will be in the mix for that for your team? Um, there's a bunch of guys that are in the running, and I'm honestly not sure who it's going to be. Uh, it's been getting, they've been rotating a lot in practice, so it'll be exciting to see who does it. But anybody that we can fit into our uh, system, we take a lot of pride in punt return. We want to have the most punt return yards in, in the whole country. So any, any of the guys that we put out back there, we're really confident in. That they'll be able to get the job done. I remember one of the kickers a couple of years ago said that Coach Hop would come over and kind of shoulder, bump him a little bit, kind of get in his face and add some pressure. To, does he do that stuff to you? Oh yeah, and the pressure kicks that I talked about earlier, he's he's right there and in, in uh, uh, with everyone else. He's hitting me. He's hitting the holder. He's <laughs> trying to mess us up as much as he can. So he really takes a lot of pride in adding that extra pressure too. One or two more. What's it like having a coach like Coach Eckler have so much energy and able to turn it on so much during practice? What's it like having a coach like that? Um, it's great. I mean, we're in practice 13 the fall camp, so it can be a little sluggish sometimes for some guys, but it's just we have to make the decision every single day, and Coach X is a great representative of making that decision and coming out with 
like it's day one every single day and just bringing a lot of energy. Hey, how much, if at all, have you talked to Morgan Cox, who's made just an unbelievably long career mm -hmm. in the NFL as a VFL? I talked to him a little last summer, and I like to build the relationship a little bit more, but he knows my cousin pretty well. My cousin played back in the day, so I talked to him about that a little bit. But, yeah, he came for the specialist camp last year, so it was cool getting to talk to him, a guy that's been doing it at the highest level for a long time. I mean, it's really – I look up to him a lot. So. Thanks, Matt. Thanks, Matt. Thank you. Appreciate you.